3. Profundo. Ve muy profundo. Muy profundo. Viaja a través del tiempo. Y sitúate ahí donde se origina la inseguridad. Lo primero que llegue a tu mente, eso está bien. Francisco, cuéntame, ¿qué estás recordando? What are you remembering right now? Um, <coughs> My dad got mad when somebody broke a piece of the air conditioner. Papa se enojó cuando alguien quebró una pieza del aire acondicionado. ¿Cuántos años tienes ahí? How old are you then? Nine. Nueve. Eight, nine. Ocho, nueve. Tengo nueve años. Papá está enojado. So we're nine years old and dad is mad. Y sígueme contando. I keep on telling her. Tells everyone to come to uh, the room where the air conditioner is. Le dice a todos que se reúnan en el cuarto donde está el aire acondicionado quebrado. He's yelling at Seba. Está gritando y está diciendo. Yo estoy contigo, no te preocupes. Siente mi energía ahí. Y dime, ¿ya están todos en el cuarto? She's here, she's with you. Feel her energy. No. Is everybody in the room now? ¿Y qué está diciendo, papá? And what is that saying? Saying that everything's broken. We don't have any nice things. The car is... Todo está quebrado, que no tenemos nada bonito. The car, the chair, the los table. Los it's all scratched up. Las mesas están todas rayadas. He's blaming everyone. Y está culpando a todos. ¿Y cómo se siente ese pequeño niño ahí? And how does that little boy feel there? He's, he's worried. Está preocupado. But he's trying to keep himself composed. He's telling him to calm down. He doesn't, he doesn't listen. <laughs> he raises his voice and <laughs> louder. Throws a piece of the air conditioner to the ground with force. Permitete llorar todo lo que quieras. Allow yourself to cry all you want. Yo aquí estoy contigo. Permite que ese niño asustado llore lo que tenga que llorar. Todos los niños a esa edad sienten miedo.
Ahora observa desde arriba. No, from above, just observe. Y flota sobre esa escena. And just float above that scene. Y ve allá abajo todo lo que sucede sin que te afecte. And from above, you're watching the scene without it affecting you. Y sigue me platicando, ¿qué hace ese señor enojón? Keep on telling you what the Z and grouchy men keep on saying. What? Keep on telling her what your dad keeps on saying or what he does from above the scene. The same, uh, that nobody takes care of anything, that we treat everything with, with, uh, with, uh, we so mistreat everything and we don't take, we take everything for, for granted. Dice que no cuidamos nada, que maltratamos todas las cosas y no apreciamos lo que tenemos. But he's, he's angry and he's... Y que está enojado. He's a man. He's... He's a... A man who's... Who's broken and uncomposed. And he's he's only he's one man with three children and a wife. He doesn't know what to do. He doesn't know what to do but scream. Recuerda que estás arriba. Remember that you are above the scene. Observando como una videocámara de seguridad. And you're just observing just as if you as if you were a security camera. Ahora yo voy a hablar con papá, con Victor. Now I'm going to talk to your dad, Victor. Le prestarás tu mente y tu boca para que se exprese. Will you allow him to express himself through you using your mouth? Eso, your se, eso se puede hacer porque somos energía. And that can be done because we're all energy. Porque todos somos canales de comunicación. Because we're all communication channels. Ahora contaré del 1 al 3. And now we're going to count from 1 to 3. Y quiero hablar con Don Victor. And we want to talk to Mr. Victor. Uno, dos, tres, cambia. Víctor, ¿por qué está gritándole hacia los chicos? Víctor, ¿por qué estás gritando a tus hijos así? Porque estoy gritando a tus hijos. Porque no sé cómo no sé cómo no sé cómo to raise these three children and no sé cómo criar a estos tres niños. Sí. Me estoy dando cuenta de su incapacidad. Yes, I'm finding that out. Hay muchas personas como usted, Don Víctor, que no saben criar niños. There's a lot of people like you, Victor, that don't know how to raise children. Y se esfuerzan mucho todos los días. And you try, and you force yourself every day. Pero gritar no es la mejor manera. But yelling is not the best way. Ya se dio cuenta cómo está. Ya se dio cuenta cómo está Francisco. Now you're aware of how Francisco is. Ya se dio cuenta que tiene miedo. Are you aware how scared he is? Yeah. Sí. Ahora, Don Victor. No, Victor. Congela esa imagen ahí. Freeze that image there. 
Francisco, ahora que papá ha congelado esa imagen, te voy a dar un control te voy a dar un comando mágico now that Francisco is here she's gonna give you Francisco a magical command y ahora que papá tiene congelada esa escena now that your dad has that image frozen tú vas a poder cambiar lo que quieras You're going to be able to change it to however you want. Y solo aprietas un botón. You just have to click the button. Y cambias lo que no te está gustando desde ahí arriba. And just like a TV channel from up above of the scene, you're going to click on the control and change the scene to something that you would enjoy. Y dime, ¿qué vas a cambiar? And tell me, what are you going to change? Puedes bajarle el volumen a los gritos. You can lower down the volume on the yelling. Puedes congelar a papá. You can freeze your dad. Puedes convertirte en con una capa mágica, transparente. You can change invisible and get an invisible cloak Dime, ¿qué vas a cambiar ahí? tell us what you're going to change in there I'm going to freeze everything and voy a freezar todo bien hecho y ahora diviértete porque nadie sabe que tienes ese comando mágico. Good job. Now have fun because nobody knows that you have that magical command. Diviértete y dime cómo congelas ahí a papá. Have fun and tell her how you freeze dad in that scene. Freeze them and sitting in the bed. La frise, si está sentado en la cama. He looks angry here. He looks like... Se mira enojado. Ahora diviértete porque está congelado. Now have fun because he's frozen. Ahora con ese comando mágico. Podrás congelarlo cada vez que te asustes o grite. Now with that magical command, you can freeze him anytime you get scared or that he yells. Pero hazlo divertido. But you gotta make it fun. Y dime, ¿también has congelado a Víctor, a tu hermano? And have you also frozen Victor, your brother? I froze everyone. He frisado a todos. Bien hecho. Bien hecho. Good job. Lo has hecho muy bien. You're doing it really good. Ahora ponen ese niño chiquito de nueve años. Mucha tranquilidad porque todos están frisados. Now, congelados. Now that everybody is frozen. You're gonna... Give that nine-year-old little boy, Francisco, some peace, some peace of mind. Ahora tú y yo juntos. Now you and I both together. Vamos a ir por Francisco chiquito. We're gonna go for little Francisco. Así como estás grande. Just like this, how? A tus 22. A 22. Tú y yo juntos. You and I together. Vamos a ir por él. We're gonna go for him. Ya nunca más nadie le va a estar gritando. So that nobody will ever yell at him. Ahora ya está Francisco el Grande. Ese hombre fuerte para cuidarlo. 
Now he has a big 22 year old Francisco. He's gonna take care of him. Ese hombre al tote. A big tall Francisco. ¿Estás listo para que vayamos por él? Sí. Bien. Ahora vamos juntos. Y aprovecha que todos están congelados. Ahora estamos tú y yo ahí, yendo por él. ¿Ya estás ahí? Y dime, ¿cómo lo ves? Everyone's frozen. This, this little boy is scared. Todos están frisados. Este niño pequeño está asustado. Ahora acaricia su cabeza ahí. Now caress his head there. Y dile ya llegué pequeño. And tell him that I'm here now. I'm here now. It's okay. Okay. Yo soy el grande, yo me encargo. <sighs> Nunca más nadie va a lastimar tu corazón. Nobody else will ever hurt you again. No one else is going to ever hurt you. <sighs> Siente mi fuerza, yo estoy aquí. ¿Estás listo para descongelar a todos y decirles que nos vamos a llevar a Francisco Chiquito? Are you ready to unfreeze everybody and tell them that we're going to take little Francisco? Yes. Bien, ahora siénteme ahí contigo. Okay, now feel me with you at that moment. Ahora sí descongela a todos. Now you unfreeze everything. Y yo estoy ahí contigo. And I'm here with you. Carga a Francisco chiquito. And carry little Francisco with you. Y diles a todos que te lo llevas. And you tell everybody that you're taking him with you. I'm taking him with me. I'm going to take him with me. Vamos a simular que este es Francisco. Agárralo, abrázalo y dile, llévatelo. I'm going to take him with me. Yes. Good job. Siénteme ahí, estoy contigo. Ahora dile, dile a papá que te lo llevas. No, tell dad that you're taking him with you. Dad, I'm going to take him with me. No es bueno tanto regaño. Not a lot of yelling is good. Your constant yelling isn't good for him. Bien hecho. Ahora dime qué hace papá, ahora que te llevas a Francisco chiquito. Now what does dad do as you're taking little Francisco with you? He stands up. Se para. And he's confused, he's... Y está confundido. He's... No se lo esperaba, ¿cierto? You didn't expect that, did he? No. ¿Estás orgulloso de ti? Are you proud of yourself? Yes. Yo también estoy muy orgullosa de ti. También de alegría, señor. ¿Verdad que sí? 
위에. <웃음> Te sientes contento? <웃음> claro que sí. <웃음> Ahora dile a Francisco chiquito que se van a divertir mucho. Now you're gonna tell little Francisco that you and him are gonna have such a great time together. Who? You're gonna tell big Francisco is gonna tell little Francisco that wherever you take him, you're gonna have such a great fun time together. Y que vas a hacer todo lo que no habías hecho. And you're gonna do everything that you didn't do before. <sighs> you and I are gonna <sighs> we're gonna have a great time, <laughs> and we're gonna do all the things that we've always wanted to do. <laughs> do you? Vamos a tener muchas diverticiones. Y vas a lograr hacer todas las cosas que no pudiste hacer antes. <risa> Bien hecho. Bien hecho. Ahora explícale que cuando sea grande. Now you're gonna explain to little Francisco that when he grows up. Tendrá algunas dificultades como todos tienen. He's gonna have difficulties in life just like everybody else porque son parte de la vida because it's just part of life Listen, when you grow up you're gonna you're gonna experience a lot of difficulties a lot of hardship and it's not gonna be easy but it's okay because When you grow up, you'll realize that everyone, everyone is going to go through the same thing. Y yo estoy aquí And I'm here. Para cuidarte. And I'm here to take care of you. I'm here to take care of you. Y no necesitas... Y no necesitarás And you're not gonna need conocer todo para tomar decisiones. And you're not gonna need to know everything to make decisions. Nos vamos a divertir juntos. We're gonna have a lot of fun together. You're not gonna know a lot. You don't need to know a lot of, of things to make decisions. And you and I We're gonna have a lot of fun. ¿Y cómo lo ves? ¿Cómo lo sientes? How do you see him? How do you feel him? He's not scared, he's happy. And he's confident. He's feliz, right? Yeah. Yeah. Buen trabajo. Que sienta tu fuerza, que sienta tus brazos fuertes, tu fortaleza interior. Y dime, ¿está tranquilo? ¿Está contento con lo que has dicho? Tell me, is he calm or is he happy from what you said to him? 
He's calm and he's he's he trusts me. He he has a lot of confidence in me and he has a lot of questions. And he has faith. He has faith in he has faith that I know all the answers. And I do. But I don't. Ahora comprométete ahí con tu corazón. Comprométete con tu corazón de que este pequeño siempre estará protegido, cuidado y amado por ti. Now, make that promise in your heart that that little boy is always going to be confident. And you're always, he's always going to be in you. Listen, I promise you that You're always going to be confident. That confidence is always going to be in you. It's always, it's always been in you, and that I'm always going to help you. Te prometo que vas a ser muy asegurado de ti mismo, muy seguro de ti mismo, y siempre te voy a ayudar. Bien hecho. Buen trabajo. Ahora explícale que va a tener un hermano que es muy molón. You're gonna have a brother who's really grouchy. Really grouchy and really stubborn and really really angry all the time. He's angry and vas a tener un hermano que siempre va a estar muy enojón. Muy frustrado. Pero, pero ya no importa. But that doesn't matter anymore. But that doesn't matter. Tú le tendrás paciencia. Because you will, you will have patience for him. Because as much as he's angry. Porque, por tanto que él está enojado. And abusive and. Y abusivo. Not there for him. He's always. You'll always be patient with him. You're always gonna be patient with him. Y yo estaré ahí para que no abuse de ti. And I will be there with you, so that he doesn't abuse. You or yell at you anymore. And I'll always be there to to help you, and he's so that he won't abuse you or or be angry with you. I'll always be there with you. Siempre voy a estar con tu lado. Y ahora dile qué vas a hacer, qué van a hacer con esos de la escuela que están también de molones, jodones, molestones. Now tell them what you're going to do regarding those bullies in school. Tengo una buena idea. Tengo una buena idea. I have a good idea. Te voy a dar el... I'm going to give you the control. Magic. The magic controller. Y a todos les vamos a los vamos a convertir en payasos. And we can all change them into clowns. En patos. Or ducks. En pollos. Or chickens. Quack 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 quack. Quieres? <laughs> you want to try it? Sure. Bien. Ahora ve a la escuela. Now go to school. Lleva a Francisco chiquito. And take little Francisco with you. Dale el control. Give him the controller. Para que los convierta a todos en patos. So that he can change him in pollos. Into ducks, chickens, whatever he wants. Payasos con pelos de colores. Crazy clowns with crazy hair. No. 
I'm gonna go with you to school. Regarding your bullies and anyone bothering you or making you feel insecure, I'm gonna give you this remote, and this remote can turn any any bully into a clown with crazy hair or dark. Ducks with no vocabulary other than quack. And Los that's all they're gonna say. Quack. This control, this control can do that for you. Este control puede hacer eso para ti. Ahora ve con él y diviértete. Okay. Go with him and have fun. Y también al teacher. And the teacher as well. Bueno. Y dime, ¿lo está haciendo bien? Tell us how he's doing. He's doing well. He's... He's in the fourth grade. And ¿Lo está haciendo bien? Está en el cuarto año. He sees a group of kids who... Other than the clowns and the ducks, he sees a group of kids that look really friendly and nice. And Se está divirtiendo mucho. He's having fun. He Se está divirtiendo. Aparte de los payasos y de los patos y pollos, ve un grupo de niños que serían buena gente. A ellos no los vas a transformar. You're not going to do anything to them? No, because okay, they're, they're friendly and you know what? They're just like you. No, porque son, son amables <laughs> y son igual como tú. Y al que más, <laughs> dile que al que más le molesta, al que más lo... <laughs> <laughs> Tell little Francisco that the meanest kid in your class, the one that most bothers you, ese lo puede convertir en lagartija. That kid, he can make him into a lizard. Y que se ría por su color verde feo. <laughs> that kid, the one that bothered you so much. Irving Ortega, the kid with the spiky hair and the pale face and the green eyes, that kid, the one who bothers you so much, guess what, you can turn him into a lizard, you know what a, li a lizard, it's one of those reptiles, I think it's, I think it's turned into a lizard, right, you turn him into a lizard, Que se divierta, que se ría mucho. Hmm. <laughs> you can laugh all you want. Le gusta. Because he's not going to do anything. He's not going to do anything. <laughs> es una lagartija fea. He's a lizard. He's not going to do anything. Ahora que lo convierte en el conejo de Pascua. Now you can turn him into the Easter Bunny. <laughs> Guess what? Todo panzón. <laughs> you know what an Easter Bunny? You know what an Easter Bunny is? You know what an Easter Bunny is? It's one of those bunnies that you see every April. 
those bunnies. You could turn him into an Easter bunny, one of those big goofy ones with the, the ones with the suit. And <laughs> you could turn him into an Easter bunny and he, he won't say anything. They don't know how to talk. It's okay. He's <laughs> Ahora le puedes decir que lo convierta en Ralph, el de, el de la tele. Ralph, from the 80s, 90s. It's Ralph. Sometimes Ralph. 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 O en el monstruo come galletas también. Monster. He could turn him into the. He could turn him into Kermit the Frog. He could turn him into Cookie Monster. He could turn him into Eagle Man. He could turn him into. Eagle man. Cada vez. Each time. Each time. Que ese pequeño. That, that little boy. Que necesite la aprobación. Que sienta necesitar la aprobación de alguien. Each time that little boy feels that he needs somebody's approval. Tú le darás ese control. You're gonna give him that control. Ese comando mágico. That magic control. Y simplemente te divertirás. And you're simply gonna have fun. Can you repeat that? Every time that little boy feels that he needs somebody's approval to succeed in life, to go on with life, you're gonna give him that magic controller because he does not need anybody's approval. Every time you feel like you need somebody's approval from your parents or from your teachers, you're going to give them this control because you don't need it. Y dime cómo está ese pequeño. Está feliz. Can you tell us how that little boy is? Is he, is he happy? Yeah. ¿Estás orgulloso de lo que has hecho hoy, Francisco? Are you proud of what you've done today, Francisco? Yeah. 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 Ha sido maravilloso. It's been wonderful. Yeah. Me gusta que sientas admiración por ti y orgullo por ti. I like that you're proud of yourself. You admire yourself. Ahora convierte ese pequeño niño en luz. Now you're gonna convert little Francisco into light. En una luz blanca y amorosa. Into a loving white. Y 
Pues hazlo chiquito, chiquito, pequeño, pequeño, pequeño. And you're gonna turn them into. I'm gonna make them smaller, smaller, smaller. Y guárdalo en tu corazón. So that he can fit inside your heart. Siempre seguro y amado por ti. So that he is always safe and loved by you. Dile que tú estás feliz con las preferencias sexuales que él tenga. Tell him that you're happy with whatever sexual preferences he may want. Y no necesita ocultarse más. And he doesn't need to hide it anymore. Porque llegaste ahí para cuidarlo y protegerlo. Because you're there to take care of him and protect him. I'm happy with whatever sexual preference that you have, and it's okay because I'll always love you and and know that if you're okay with it, everyone's gonna be okay with it. And if anybody has a problem, it's none of their business. I Estoy feliz I'll con tus decisiones de tu vida. Y tú puedes escoger cualquier ser como tú quieras. Y si alguien tiene un problema, no va a importar. Wow. Ahora siéntete feliz por esas palabras y orgulloso. Ahora si el universo lo permite. Now the universe allows it. Busquemos la comunicación con la abuela. Let's find the communication line between you and grandma. ¿Lo quieres hacer? You want to do this? Yes. yes. Te sientes gustoso, estás contento de hacerlo. Would you be happy to do it? Yes. Bien. Ahora pregúntale a la abuelita si está bien en donde está. Y la respuesta llega natural a tu mente. Now ask grandma if she's okay where she's at. And the answer is going to come to the mind naturally. Abuelita, ¿estás bien donde estás? ¿Está bien? Ella está bien, pero ella está... Ella está contenta. ¿Dónde está? Pregúntale a la abuela si está bien en la luz. Si está en la luz. Abuelita, ¿estás bien en la luz? Dale un fuerte abrazo. Dile todo lo que la amas a la abuela. Pregúntale qué opina de lo que hoy hiciste con Francisco Chiquito. Ahorita, ¿qué, op qué opinas? Oh. What do you think of, of little Francisco?
pues tengo la natural a tu cabeza. The answer is it's going to come naturally to mine. You don't need to force them. She said. That she's happy. That she thinks that. Dice que está feliz. He has a beautiful soul. Y que piensa que tiene una alma muy bella. And that. And that he loves that. That. He loves the fact that he. Today treats people with kindness. Can you repeat that? He loves the f she loves the fact that he that he treats people with kindness even today. La abuela dice que aprecia y ama la manera en cual Francisco trata a la gente con con amabilidad desde que era pequeño hasta hoy. ¿Le quieres preguntar a la abuela si ella sabe de tus preferencias sexuales? Do you want to ask grandma if she knows about your sexual preferences? ¿Qué opina? What does she think? She knows that I am my own person. Ella sabe que yo soy mi propia persona. And that, that he should be okay with whatever preference he chooses. Y él va a estar bien con cualquier preferencia que él escoja. ¿Te sientes orgulloso por eso y de ti mismo? Do you feel proud of that and proud of yourself? Yes. That's what matters. Porque tu belleza interior. Because your inner beauty. Tu esencia. Your essence. Como creación del padre. Like God's creation. No tiene que ver nada con tus preferencias sexuales. It doesn't have to do with your sexual preferences. Tú eres parte de ese universo y de esa creación divina. Because you are part of this universe and this divine creation. ¿Qué te dice la abuela? She says that she'll, she'll love me no matter what. Abuela me va a querer, no importa. No importa. ¿Estás feliz con eso, cierto? Sí. Yeah. Pregúntale qué debes hacer cuando te digan que no vas a poder independizarte, que no vas a poder lograr cosas. Cuando papá o mamá te transmitan sus miedos personales. Ask grandma what are you going to do when people tell you that you can't be independent when your parents project their fears on you. What you ask her what you should do. What should I do when my parents project their fears and insecurities on me and when they tell me that I can't do anything and when they tell me that I'll never be able to, to move on my own, what should I do? ¿Quieres repetir lo que la abuela te dice? 
Do you want to repeat what Grandma is saying? Know that that they were once your age. Ten en cuenta que ellos en una vez tenían tu edad. And that they they were your age and they were scared. Y tenían mucho miedo of their parents. Tenían miedo de sus padres. And what they projected on to them. Y lo que ellos les daban a Ten en cuenta que ellos eh, tenían tu edad antes y los padres de tus padres proyectaban su miedo hacia ti. That's only because that's only because they were scared. Pero nada más porque ellos tenían mucho miedo. And what you should do. You should acknowledge that. Lo que tienes que hacer es reconocer eso, reconocer el miedo. At the same time. Y a la misma vez. I want you to be strong and know that you're confident. Quiero que seas fuerte. In succeeding. And whatever fears and doubts you'll have, know that your parents have had them too, and they still do. Ahora quieres pedir a la abuela que solicite autorización a la luz para retirar el dolor de tus articulaciones. Now do you want to ask grandma to ask for authority from the light to take away your pain from the joints and hands? Can you repeat that? Do you want to ask grandmother to ask permission from the light so that she can have the authority to take away the pain that you feel in your joints? Can I ask permission for you to take authority to take all the pain away from my joints? Ask her to ask the light uh, for permission. Can you ask the light for permission? See what I can do. Voy a ver lo que puedo hacer. Bien. Que pida autorización. She needs to ask for permission. Did you have permission? She asked them, and the light is thanking her request and consideration. Ella le preguntó la luz y lo están considerando. After much 
thought and consideration they they've approved it y después de mucho um, pensar y consideración lo han aprobado bien hecho ahora quisieras perdonar a papá quisieras perdonar a Víctor quisieras perdonar a todas aquellas personas que te han lastimado tu corazón para que hoy te liberes de todo eso now would you like to forgive your dad would you like to forgive Victor and anybody else who has hurt you in your heart so you can get rid of that pain Yes. Bien. Dile a la abuela y a la luz que hoy perdonas a todos y cierras ese ciclo de dolor en tu vida. Hoy se termina. And tell your grandmother that you tell the grandmother and, and the light that you have forgiven all those people that have hurt you in the past. And all that pain and discomfort ends today. I've forgiven anyone and everyone who's hurt me in the past and in the present and all that pain that pain will, will go away and eventually before, before I know it the pain will be gone perdonado a todos estás orgulloso de ti yes. bien hecho y dime ese Francisco chiquito que está ahí en tu corazón también está orgulloso de lo que has hecho sí Maravilloso. Maravilloso, excelente. Ahora entrégale a la abuela todo ese dolor de tu cuerpo, de tus articulaciones, que se lo lleve. Te autorizaron, ya se puede. Now you're going to give grandma all of that pain that you feel in your body and give it to her. So she could take it away because she was authorized to do so. She what? She was authorized to do so. She had permission to take all that pain away from you. Y ahora dile a la abuela que tú pondrás tu parte y dejarás de tronarte tus dedos. Now tell grandma that you will do your part and stop cracking your knuckles. Crack them. What? Tell grandma that you're going to do your part to stop your joint pain and you're going to stop cracking your knuckles. No quieres hacer? I'm going to do my part to stop cracking my knuckles to make sure that I won't do it as much as much not y que dice la abuela she says okay that's okay excellent Le quieres preguntar si tiene un mensaje para mamá. Do you have anything to say to m Do you have anything to say to mom? I loved her. I love her. Her, her brothers and her sister. 
Sus hermanos y a su hermana los, los aman. Then, I've done all that I can. Y hice todo lo que pude. And that I want you to do all that you can for your for your daughters and your and your sons. Y quiero que tú hagas todo lo que tú puedas. And know that para tus hijos. That your daughters and your sons will do the same thing to their children. Y quiero que sepas que tus hijas y tus hijos van a hacer lo mismo para sus hijos y sus hijas. <laughs> Gracias a la abuelita porque ya nos vamos a despedir. Despedir es un decir porque ya sigue ahí contigo. Gracias abuelita. Y dile si hay alguna otra cosa más que te quiera decir. Ask her if there's anything else that she wants to tell you. Is there anything else that you want to tell me? Yeah. I want you to love yourself. Quiero que te ames a ti mismo. And to love those around you. Y quiero que ames a todos los alrededor de ti. And when you find someone. Y cuando encuentres a alguien. Who you feel a deep connection to. Que te conectes. You tell them how you feel. Cuando ves, ahí es alguien quien te conectes, tú le vas a decir todo, todo a ellos y todo lo que tú sientes por ellos. Eso significa, Francisco, que desde hoy eres un hombre libre. That signifies, Francisco, that as of today you are a free man. Hoy inicia esa segunda etapa en tu vida. Today, that second stage of your life initiates. ¿Estás listo? Are you ready? Yeah, yeah. Excelente. Despídete de la abuelita y prepárate porque vamos a regresar. Now, say bye to grandmother, even though it's just a saying, because she's always going to be here. And get ready to come back. Goodbye, Grandma. I know that you're going to be with me. I'm going to go now. Despedirnos es un decir, porque ella siempre está ahí. Saying goodbye is just a saying, because she's always going to be there. O pregúntale a ella, por ejemplo, tal vez yo me equivoque. Or ask her, <coughs> maybe she has something else to say. Do you have anything else to say?
if you're ever scared or happy or I'll always be there. Cuando tú estés triste o feliz, yeah. de todos modos voy a estar, voy a estar ahí. <coughs> in any major event in your life, your wedding, your, your new job, tu boda, tu trabajo, promotions, tus promociones de trabajo, birth, the birth of your of your first child, y and so on. De tu primer hijo, yo voy a estar ahí. ¿Estás feliz? Sí. Yo también estoy muy feliz por ti. Ya se ha ido la abuela. Ya. Yeah. Ya se fue. Ahora yeah. vamos a retirar esto. Y voy a ir contando del 1 al 5. Y con cada número irás regresando, dueño de tu mente y dueño de tu cuerpo, sintiéndote diferente, utilizando siempre tu comando mágico para cambiar, hacer los patos o pollos o conejos de pascua. Siempre muy divertido con Francisco aquí en tu corazón. Sintiéndote feliz. Fortalecido. Fuerte. Diferente. Seguro de ti mismo. con actitud positiva y sabiendo que tú eres lo más valioso que tienes Y aquí te vas a llevar tu control, tu comando mágico. Y te vas a divertir mucho. Siempre muy divertido. Uno, estamos regresando. Te sientes feliz y renovado. Seguimos regresando y esa pesadez de tu cuerpo se va, desaparece, fuera. Se va esa pesadez. Ahora como que flotas. Te sientes ligero y liviano. Cuatro, seguimos regresando. Te sientes muy tranquilo. Seguimos regresando. Cinco. Feliz en equilibrio y en perfecta armonía. Cuando estés listo, Francisco, puedes abrir tus ojos. Que ya terminé.
¿Estás listo para seguir con tu segunda etapa, Francisco? Sí. Bien. ¿Cuánto tiempo crees que llevas ahí recostado? Dos horas. <ríe> sí. Se, se le hicieron dos horas. Ah, oh, sí. Ah, yeah. oh, no. Viste el reloj. No. Pero yo. I heard it. The. 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 The beeping sound. Like I heard it uh, twice. Oh, es que. Porque es son, que sonaba. Es que sonaba el ti. <laughs> Francisco, si te pongo cuadritos, quisieras que compartiéramos tu sesión. Do you want to publish it on YouTube if she gets all out your face? Sí, pero no importa. Uh -huh. Oh, qué valiente. ¿Sin cuadritos entonces o con cuadritos? No, como así está bien. ¿Cómo así? Sí. ¿Qué quiere? ¿Cuál? Sí, sí. Sin bloquearlo. Yeah, like no pixels. Uh -huh. 